everyone, welcome to Girl Talk World. We are with Jacqueline Wilson today and we are doing a challenge. <laughs> and it's a challenge for you as well. So we have a few blown up sections of the covers of Jacqueline's books. And we want to see if you can tell which book it is just by a little snippet and okay. you have to decide. You can, well, you have to see if you can tell as well. Okay, are you ready? Mm -hmm. First one. Ah, oh, I know. This is the story of Hetty Feather. It is the story of Hetty Feather. Correct. You might have cheated, I don't know. You might no, have seen that one early. <laughs> <laughs> okay, ready. Next one. Number two. Am I holding it the right way? Yes. Ah, <laughs> oh, that is double act. That's one of the twins, either Ruby or Garnet. Correct. Two out of two. Okay. Third one. Um, this one we put as a bit of a decoy. This is a... I think that's the Lottie project. Am I right? <laughs> yes, you are. Because it has... It's kind of a heady feather it look. It looks exactly like that. <laughs> yeah. We thought, I'm going to include that. Okay, next one. Okay. I think this one will be... Oh, okay. easy. Yeah, that's the story of Tracy Beaker, and there's poor Peter. <laughs> <laughs> I do love Peter. Why do you think poor me? <laughs> okay. Uh, that's the suitcase kid. That was very quick, right? I'm a big Nick Sharrett fan. <laughs> yeah. Yes, how did you feel the first time you saw yourself drawn by Nick Sharrett? Oh, I, I love the way Nick draws me, though he did once draw me rather like a chipmunk with sort of a cheese <laughs> bulging out. I did say, could you make a little bit bigger? Yes. <laughs> I think it does really look like you as well. It's mm. amazing, because his, his drawings are so simple, but they look ex exactly like what they're supposed to look like. I don't know if that sounds silly, but then. Okay, this one. Ah, oh, that's the bed and breakfast star because I've recognised Elsa's wild hair. I feel like hair is a really big part of a lot of your characters. Oh, I'm defining. Love choosing the hair <laughs> <Yeah>. star. <laughs> okay, we've got four more. Ah, oh, now this is one of my newest books. This is Rose Rivers. Am I right? Correct. Okay. Ah, this is a tricky one, but <laughs> there is a toad there. So this is one of my least well-known books and it's called Plop Slime. It sure is. We picked this because Deputy <laughs> Editor Becky Loves club slime. Really? Oh, how nice. <laughs> so we had to include it first. Well, Rebecca. <laughs> yeah, yes. That's why. <laughs> okay. Oh. Ah. Um. Mm. That I see a dustbin, and I think that's a baby. So that has to be dustbin baby. It is dustbin. Dustbin baby. Okay. Last one. Ah. And that one is buried alive and that's poor Tim at the seaside with a spade <laughs> being buried alive. Not serious. <laughs> <laughs> and it's quite a serious like scary book by the way. <laughs> right we've got 10 out of 10. I do. <laughs> yeah we're gonna put some big things on this. <laughs> I hope you got 10 out of 10 at home. If you didn't know any of them check them out obviously and check out Jacqueline Wilson's new book, My Mum Tracy Beaker, which is out on the 4th of October. Thank you so much. Thank you. <laughs> Bye. Bye.